40 riders representing 17 different nations have come to Shanghai for the fourth leg of the Longines Global Champions Tour. It is the third time that the tour have visited Shanghai and year after year crowds pack into this showground which is in the shadow of the China Art Palace. Close to half a million US dollars is up for grabs in the big class, the Grand Prix. It's the one they all want to win. Let's see what happens. All eyes were on the world's top three ranked riders and they didn't disappoint. Simone de Lest, Christian Ullman and Scott Brash all made the up to height first round course look easy. They were safely through to the second round along with 11 other faultless combinations. Of the three, it was the overall rankings leader who impressed in the next round. His beautiful grey stallion colour it skipped around what was a tricky course. Of the 14 first round players, only five managed another one, but it was a classy group which would guarantee an exciting deciding jump off. First in, two-time tour winner Edwina Tops Alexander put the pressure on the remaining four riders with a fast clear. It was better though by the next rider in, Mark Houtsager, and then again by Marco Kutcher. His experienced Bay stallion Van Gogh looked to have set an unbeatable time. The final two riders would need to do something remarkable. Ullman was up on the clock but rubbed the final fence, so it came down to the very last rider into the ring. 42 uh, he's 27. Trying. He's trying. Oh, steady up. That clears it. And it's 41 97. An historic Tour Grand Prix victory for Saudi Arabia and the winning rider Abdullah Al Shabatli, whose plan came off. I was really riding this horse twice a day for the last two and a half months, no jumping, and I was really protecting him. I did not show him. I could show him in many, many events, but I was always protecting him, and uh, and I'm always I'm always keeping one or two grooms, especially for this horse. Uh, I'm really caring a lot of him. I'm really doing a lot of care, and I'm really take care of him. And uh, like the vets check him every week, and uh, I'm always updating everything on this horse. I really love him.